hi guys welcome to my channel nox kissing in this video i want to share with you how to make the french toast the nigerian way and i'm going to be using the nigerian agege bread so guys let's jump right into the video hi guys welcome to my food channel nox kissing my name is kari the channel is about cooking kitchen etiquette and equipment guys so guys let me share with you what we need to make this we need our egg we need salt we need pepper and we need different spices so the first step is to break your eggs into a bowl and then you add salt so you can add a pinch of salt but i'm using this for salt depends on how you want it okay and then you add your spice cube okay your chicken cube which you see me add so after adding your chicken cube there's something important that has to go in before you mix it and this is our pepper so i'm going to be using the dried pepper and i'm going to be using this is my measurement spoon to measure it measure it so it depends on how you know you like your pepper so me i like pepper i'm just going to go ahead to add it in the bowl so after adding it yeah I'll go ahead to mix the mixture. So you have to mix it properly until the salt, the pepper, and the chicken spices mix properly. Okay. So you know it's not going to be very smooth, but then it's going to be properly mixed. So the next step is to go ahead to cut my agigi bread to slice it. Okay. So you can use sliced bread if you want, but I'm making use of agigi bread. So I'm just going to quickly slice it up and then go to the next step of making our Nigerian French toast. So now that we have our agigi bread sliced, we want to, you know, put it in the egg mixture. So because I'd left the egg to slice the bread, I have to mix it up again. So now that I mixed it, I go to the next step which is to dip the bread into the egg batter so you make sure like you dip it all around you know from the edges to the center everywhere okay so our two egg made three um bread of um agigi sliced bread okay so these are the three breads so i'm going to go to the next step which is to heat my frying pan so after i eat my frying pan i add a little oil so i'm adding this oil you know for it to go around in the fry pan and then i will now reduce it okay so you can either add a little oil or you know um use oil spray for your fry pan or add oil then drain it out when it's hot so now that the fry pan is hot with the oil i go ahead to put the bread you can see that when you put in the bread it's going to be um because if the oil is hot it's going to start frying okay so you have to fry in medium heat so that it doesn't get burnt so after putting the two oil in the fry pan i'm going to leave it for some time to fry so after it has fried a little i'll go ahead to turn it over okay so that the next part of the bread can fry okay it's important to know that this meal is very delicious and it's very very fast to make you know if you are rushing and you want to make breakfast this is like the first go to meal to go so now that the other side has fried a little you can see it's a little bit brown you turn it over for the next side to fry properly okay Voila guys, our French toast is ready and I'm super excited and I can't wait to eat it. So guys, I'm just going to do the same step for the remaining bread. So guys, our French toast is ready and I want you guys to join me as we eat it. So I hope that you try out this recipe and you let me know how easy it was for you. So guys, thank you for watching this video. 
do remember to like to share to subscribe turn on the notification button you can check out all my other breakfast videos it's in my description and it's also in my channel you can also check out how to make different types of sandwiches and um, thank you once more for watching this video share with your friends guys so mm, this looks so delicious and nice and yeah we'll see you guys in my next video bye guys <music>